Sears announced today it will sell its Ala Moana Center store to the center's owner, General Growth Properties. But the store will remain open for now. KITV4's Jody Leong tells us the move follows years of losses for one of Ala Moana's flagship stores. Sears was one of the original tenants when Ala Moana Center opened in 1959. In recent years, a department store has struggled, reporting a fourth quarter net loss of $2.4 billion. Sears says a sale makes good business sense. It is selling 11 stores in nine states to General Growth Properties for $270 million. General Growth owns Ala Moana Center and a total of 169 shopping malls in 43 states. But the 11 Sears stores will continue to operate into 2013. Sears corporate office in Chicago tells us that closure dates will not be determined until later this year and the closures will not start until 2013. But as news of the sale and impending closures spread, the reaction from customers was mixed. It's very sad. It's a staple. It's an icon. It's the default for like when you don't know exactly where you need to go for it. Usually you go to Sears and they got what you need. It's been around for a long time. As long as I was little, I'd shop at Sears. So. It's just really sad that it's going to go. Sears is really outdated right now. I think that its time has come just like JCPenney's had its time. But I do see that you have a Sears bag. <laughs> yes, I do. But times change. So I think, I, I think it might be a good thing. It depends on who takes over. General Growth told KITV4 News this is an important acquisition, an opportunity to recapture some valuable property and to continue providing the best in retail and entertainment. General Growth would not say what it has in mind for this prime spot, only that there is great interest from retailers across the board. At Ala Moana Center, Jody Leon, KITV4 News. The sale between Sears and General Growth is expected to close in the next 45 to 60 days.